second. Sometimes I can't even film a video because Oscar is in the way. Hi, buddy. Hi. Hang on. <laughs> okay, so here's one from Zipax. Um, as you guys know, I got the shoulder pouch. The foam patch for my uh, hyperlight. But for this video, after a review video that, that we put out, um, I'm going to end up using this as my shoulder pouch for my phone instead of the foam pouch I got originally. And then as a water, water bottle holder, I'm going to end up using this instead. So, yeah. So, that's a couple of carabiners right here, top and bottom. Water pouch. pouch. Slide the strap right here. Be good to go. And now for this one here, I don't have any... Uh, thing. Yep. So got this. You can see the mouse drop. Now it's a cold drop. Or the Sierra. It's a camp person. Mm -hmm. Not bad. This is uh, the iPad for the heroes. What? Oh, um, maybe I need you. Oh, am I interrupting? No, it's fine. Oh. You want me to come in with you? Hi! Hi! Hey, this is Mike. Mike, this is the phone oh, yeah. Got an email notification um, that uh, my quilt. Just came in, so I'm on my way to the office to go pick it up. Should be one of these big boxes, though. Ooh, big boxes. Okay. It's gonna be one of these. I have a little lunch here. This is the tomato soup that you get from the grocery store. I didn't talk about um, the reason being of why I got the IKEA bag, which is $4.99. Um, this is basically a big duffel bag that handles uh, the carry right here. And it's also like a backpack. And my second plan if I didn't put the permit that I wanted was to um, mail my whole backpack to my mom in Florida because I'm going to go spend at least a couple of days with her before I do my, uh, my hike and then take the whole thing with me from Florida to um, to California so um, my backpack shipped and everything in here and my uh, quilt 
blah blah. Kind of battery came in today, so I'm going to see. I mean, it's a pretty light box. Um, get that weight in and everything, you know. So just have watch it, and I'll unbox this for you guys. All right, I got my scale with me right here. This open here. So I got this at uh, whatever price. Uh, uh, I did return back the, the REI uh, magnet bolt. And in the box, get rid of that right there. It's in a plastic bag. Got some instructions. Okay. I paid. Four sixty-five, and I got the overfill of two ounces. And got the sticker. Gotta put this on my air bolt. Anything else in the box? This actually is said to be an additional two or three weeks, but it came in a normal time. Um, when did I order this? Doesn't say when I ordered it though. Oh, June fifth. Uh, um, so it takes almost about a month. You get the cotton bag coming with it. It's for storage. This is for taking it to do on the hiking. Straps. Secure it to the pad. And I am not familiar with this one here. This is this is pretty heavy. Okay. So I got the tags on here. A hundred fill. And we can say it's two ounce. This is the short version because I am I am a short guy. Wait, uh, probably should take the tags off. So I'm just going to weigh this without uh, letting the strap or anything. And then put the box in here. And zero it out. And then we'll put the bag. And over here, it is 21.41 ounces for this. So, went from a um, 16 ounce trail magma 30 degrees to a, uh, this is a, this is a 22 degree. Hoping with the overfill is going to be about 20 degree bag. Yeah, so it looks, looks really nice. Um, this is the one I'm going to be carrying through the whole time since I am leaving in, uh, in March. So I will be taking this to the Mount the Wonderland Trail and try, try it out. Um, so yeah, pretty excited. See, with this quality bag here, the stitching doesn't go through like the, the REI Magma does. Feels really, really warm. But yeah, this is my um thought that would be taken with me. And I'll be using um a hyperlight mountain bag instead of this here. <laughs> 